Yo. Ugh. All right, let's see if I can do this again. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. It goes like this. Big boy Rick. What up, what up? Fucking check. Alright, um, here we go. Let's get right into it. Because I'm gonna start rambling. So, this is from, I think, 2002. Uh, I've stumbled on all this. I've had it for a while. Uh, what it is, is, uh, it's Mark Harris on, um, I guess it was called, uh, I don't know, Oxygen Network, some sort of gay TV network, and he was, and they do their own version of Cribs, and uh, let's get right to it, let's see if this works. Then, on abodes, we tour a Hollywood mansion fit for a queen. Well, hello! I'm Mark Harris. How are you? Welcome to my abode, the Patriotic Palace. Mark Harris, his home sweet home. Well, hello! I'm Mark Harris. How are you? Welcome to my abode, the Patriotic Palace. Here we go. Now, I'm going to take you into the living room, 1,200 square feet. We appropriate call it the Grand Ballroom. The look here is called high on eclectic and potpourri of everything. I did these couches most recently. They were the couches Martha Ray and I bought in red and black cotton. They go both ways like me. My gardener, my handyman. Uh, let me invite him in. Hi, America. I mean, what don't you do here? Everything, planting, cleaning, you know. Everything but bathe. America's most treasured patriot, Martha Ray, as the Polydent Lady. There she is in all her glory. And by the way, I still have the tea. This room is dedicated to the spirit of Martha Ray and for the three wars she served in by her own choice. Green fucking beret this there. This room is a testament. This one is very special. A blind soldier did this. He was wounded in action and from memory, being blind, he did this in 1971. Well, hi again. This is the bedroom. My bedroom. Very few colors will clash with green. And that would be on the far <laughs> right, Rudy Lee and Jeffries. Debbie Reynolds and Martha Ray wearing my shirt. But no, if you look at it, Martha is not holding Debbie Reynolds. <laughs> Why, hello! <laughs> Leaving the palace and coming outside. Oh, and you I love when they work. See, America's cooking. In keeping up with the murals, defending America, I did this right after 9-11. Our president, George Bush Jr., uh, right here, here he is, and I just hope he defends us as best he can. Just cut to that Truman way. Bomb the MFers. Feel the spirit of Martha Ray help protect the USA. When we entertain in the house, it's all in here. <laughs> Everybody just comes in here and we have a good old time. T E double R O R I S T terrorist. I'm just a gigolo, and everywhere I go, people, the people know the part I'm playing. People know the part I'm playing. Swam, bam, alakazam. Wonderful, you pass by. Quiet on the set.
That's all, folks. A bow would just get out of here. I have enough to do. And there you go. Oh, it resets. So, I'll have to go back through that. But that's the fucking infamous Martha Bray house. That's the mansion that was destroyed in the uh, the earthquake 30 years ago. 94, something like that. 95, 94, I don't know. And uh, I'm pretty sure that mansion got pretty fucked up. But that's the same one. So he had tours. Remember Howard was bitching or asking him about his neighbors? I guess he lived in this like fancy neighborhood. Not fancy necessarily, but a place where you pay enough money, you don't have a tour bus cutting up through your fucking street. And he had tour buses come by and Someone put a garden hose in his house? Something like that? I don't remember. I don't remember. Anyway. Anyway. We can watch it again. Go slow. There we go. Let's try that. But. Let's see if this works. Come on, you go back. Hello. Hello. That's naughty. All right. Then, on Abodes, we tour a Hollywood mansion fit for a queen. Well, hello! I'm Mark Harris. How are you? Welcome to my abode, the Patriotic Palace. Mark Harris, his home sweet home. <laughs> okay. So this is painted. Holy shit, he's got the whole, uh, <laughs> the windows. It's so fast, it's hard to pause and well, cast the shit. Well, hello! I'm Mark Harris. How are ya? Welcome to my abode, the Patriotic Palace. Here we go. Now, I'm going to take you into the living room. 1,200 square feet. The appropriate call. Got a self-portrait right behind him. The look here is called High on Eclectic. High on I did these couches most recently. They were the couches Martha Ray and I bought in red and black cotton. They go both ways like me. Just like me. Both ways. My gardener, my handyman. Uh, let me invite him in. Hi, America. I mean, what don't you do here? Everything. Planting, cleaning. You know. Hi, America. Everything but bathe. <laughs> America's most treasured Patriot Martha Ray as the Polydent Lady. Yeah, there's Martha. There she is, and all. I guess I kind of remember her from commercials when I was really little, but vaguely. And then the videos, we'll have to show it some other time. One when he has a party. Her glory. And by the way, I still have the teeth. Yeah, I mean, he said he was going to keep the teeth, and I guess you take the false teeth and put them upside down, and somehow that becomes an ashtray. Which is kind of gross, but it is funny. This room is dedicated to the spirit of Martha Ray and for the three wars she served in by her own choice. This room is a testament to patriotism. I'm sure Martha saw her share of shit. This one is she very helped special. The people over there. A blind soldier did this. He was wounded in action and from memory, being blind, he did this in 1971. Fucking big house. Well, hi again. Okay, this is, this the, is the fucking My room bedroom. of horror. Very few colors will clash with green. Okay, hold and on. that would be this on the fall picture. And Jeffries. Uh, <laughs> and Jeffries. I'm not sure I know who that is. Debbie Reynolds. There's Martha wearing his shirt. And then Howard. 
<laughs> it's like looks like Howard nineteen ugh, doesn't even fucking matter. <laughs> it's like early nineties Howard, but they actually took out the horrible hairdo and made it less ridiculous. Debbie Reynolds and Martha Ray wearing my shirt, but no, if you look at it, Martha is not holding Debbie Reynolds. T- <laughs> Why, hello! <laughs> Leaving the palace and coming outside. Oh, Looks like a low rider mirror. Work. See, America. Hello! <laughs> Reynolds and Martha Ray wearing my shirt. Yeah, dude, that's no, a hood of a low rider. Not- hey, man. They got the dingle balls. Not holding Debbie Reynolds. T- when they work. Right. See, America's cooking. In keeping up with the murals defending America, I did this right after 9-11. Our president, George Bush Jr., uh, right here. Here he is, and I just hope he defends us as best he can. Just cut to that Truman way. Bomb the MFers. Feel the spirit of Martha Ray help protect the USA. Yeah, this is a... Uh... 2002. This is house. way. It's all in here. Everybody just comes in here and we have a good America's. old time. He was always patriotic, but this is definitely that time. R I S T terrorist. I'm just a gigolo. Who the fuck is this? Everywhere I go, people know the part I'm playing. People know the part I'm playing. Fucking Ronnie Munn. God. Bless America. <laughs> Leo the Lion. <laughs> My home. Sweet. I fucking love Mark Harris. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That fucking picture. Do you see that? Hold on. I got a. There's a couple of snapshots here. Hold on. Oh, I fucking missed it. I'll do one more try. Yeah, look at that. What a beautiful helmet. Looks like a... Uh, oh, what the fuck would you even call that? So what is he? Probably... High school? Would that be like a high, one of those old high school uh, pictures? Or is that college? Anyway... A young Mark Harris. Hello. Oh, there he is again. I think we've seen that one. Whatever. I tried. That one. That's all, folks. A bow just get out of here. I have enough to do. Rest in peace, Ma. Rest in peace. Rest in peace, Ma Garrett. I love him, dude. Fucking love Mark Harris. Sorry if my mic was blowing you out. Anyway, I'm thinking about trying to get back into this. So that's all there is to it. I'm working on a uh, a uh, video, a pre-recorded kind of a video and deep dive of that documentary that just came out a month ago, the uh, Shock Walk Jock one on Vice. I uh, go to Vice TV on the website. You can pretty much watch it for free. Uh, dark Side of the 90s, Dark Side of the 2000s, Shock Jock. Yeah, something like that. Like I'm not gonna look it up, but something like that. Vice. I watched it on my computer. Usually I do everything on the phone, but it's definitely interesting. If uh, if uh, most of you people here, especially people that go hang out here, know about all of that, uh, the whole documentary, you know, you you know it well. Um, there's a little bit about an Open Anthony. That, uh, I don't know all the deep, all the like nuts and bolts history of Open Anthony, but I do know quite a bit. 
and I don't know anything about Man Cow. I've just I've heard of the guy, and he's a radio DJ. That's all I know. Those guys are in it. Um, who's in it? Grillo's in it. Stuttering John is in it. Uh, Tim Sabian. Um, these are people that actually are interviewed on camera. Uh, who's the other one? Uh, fucking Doug Goodstein. It looks like he aged like 30 years. Anyway. Uh, it's pretty good. It's interesting. It's worth... It was worth like, I don't know. It's an hour and a half. It's two 45 minute halves. But I'm working on uh I've recorded it and trying to do something different with that for fun since I know something about it. Anyway, Mark's fingers must have smelled terrible. I bet. I bet, I bet. Jeez, do I have anything else good here? No, that's it. Anyway. I'm hoping to get some motivation and try to do some more streams. Anyway. Thanks for all watching. Uh, keep it real. And uh, leave some comments about Mark Harris. Let me know if you want me to do more of this. Alright. Peace and love.